Good morning everyone, William here, a PSV3 user sharing on the market outlook for today, 8th of March 2019. We will start as usual from the 6th major forex market. Okay, this is the EURUSD day chart as you can see here. Okay, make it down so you can see the pivot here. Okay, today the day sentiment is still a bear so we might see even more downside today. As long as it can stay below 1.1192, okay. Currently, it's now below, okay. and the KSI is also red, so potentially more downside. Especially, we might see it testing the 1.11399 pivot level. Let's see in the M30 chart itself. Okay, M30 chart itself is still outside the GTH hour. For PSV3 user, they can either go slow on the sizing to enter short here now. Or they can just miss the trade and wait for the GTH hour to start, then the trade. Okay, because usually before the GTH hour, the market will move slow and will move around the this opening price of today. Okay, but then uh, it all depends back to the trade itself. Okay, let's see for the pound. Pound. Okay, yesterday also have a big drop here. Okay, yesterday was a drop for. 113 dips from high to low okay for pound i think is normal okay you can see here this one is as big as it can go also so 113 dips yesterday from high to low but ksi is still green so that's why i say this down movement is still limited actually okay for pound to see a 200 point 200 pips drop is not is not unusual but let's see for today Currently, day sentiment is neutral, still KSI green, so there won't be, we might see a limited downside only. But then let's say in the M30 chart itself, okay, M30 chart itself, the pound is trading higher, okay, or slightly higher, okay, above the opening price of today. And the KSI is green, okay, day neutral, so PSV3 user can either just skip the trade, there's no trade at all because there's no color change here unless you're using the yesterday's one which is actually not very valid okay but then uh, of course psv3 system gives back to the trader what it wants to do okay they we only give the guidelines of how to tra how to use it but then it, it goes back to the trader how they want to trade okay okay now uh, they can choose to skip and wait for the GTH to start and then see more movement later. For Aussie itself, okay, the day sentiment is a bear. KSI is red, so as usual, more downside can be seen. Yesterday, I also mentioned that uh, Aussie might be testing the 0 0.7000 level. Well, it missed by a fractional pip, as you can see here. Okay, see on the, okay, uh, you cannot see here because the numbers are covered. But then this one, the low of this bar itself is 0 0.77, 0 0.70049. It missed by 4 pips. Okay, so will it test today? I don't know. But then more downside may be potentially see towards the pivot 2 level. 69845 currently at 70119. Okay, let's say the M30 chart itself. Okay, M30 chart itself, KSI is green, although there's a color change from yellow to red here, day is bare, okay, so downside might be limited. Traders who entered here, okay, PSV3 users who entered here will tune, tone down their sizing, and if there's profit, do book, because the downside seems to be limited, and then you can trail the remaining profits, remaining positions. Okay, that's all for Aussie, and then dollar yen itself okay dollar yen itself yesterday after a downside there's no color change yet but today is flickering but then yesterday the dollar yen closed below the cage of daily so that's why we might see more weakness today especially now it's staying below 111.53 okay so more downside might be seen the but then the cash is still green but then uh, the day sentiment is bare so this downside might be limited, but we will see in the M30 chart itself. Okay, M30 chart itself, there's a color change from yellow to red, which is a signal to short. 
but then the signal haven't show up yet because the price itself is recovering unless the price goes back below then we might see a signal to short here okay psv3 system is a simple system so wherever there's a signal to short there's a word short came out and a potential tp also came out okay ksi is green the day sentiment is bear sorry ksi is red day sentiment is bear so when the signal short is given later traders can psv3 users sorry psv3 users can go for a short for uh, dollar yen okay but still outside gth so maybe can consider slightly little bit uh, and maybe 75 percent from your usual normal size okay for this shot okay and then for swiss franc itself as you can see after the color change on the day chart right it's still going up yesterday i also mentioned to concentrate on the long side hopefully traders or psv3 users did the did the right thing okay this upside uh, is quite okay okay and then the uh, case is still green the day sentiment for today is bull let's say in the m30 chart sorry m30 chart itself okay in the m30 chart as you can see there is a color change from red to yellow so it's a long signal but then uh, it's still outside the GTH hour, so please really uh, either miss it or tone down your sizing. Okay, because if not, we might see just uh, you will have to endure the sideways movement if it stays in, around the OP level. Okay, but then if the market do come, we might see it testing even higher to pivot one at 1.01461. Okay, currently at 1.01137. Let's see, the last one is dollar Canadian. Oh, very nice upside uh, as expected yesterday. Still an uh, upside, although it's a smaller one because we have seen a lot of big movement for what? One, two, three, four days. So this uh, small upside is expected. I was actually expecting a doji yesterday, right? I did say. Okay, but then today still concentrate on the long side with KSI Green. Let's see. Okay, but currently the day setting is neutral, so traders might wait for a while and also still outside the GTH hour. You can choose to wait for later. Case okay, I still green. So traders, PSV3 users, uh, do wait. Okay, currently now the day sentiment is a bull. If you're going long on this, please just tone down your sizing. Maybe 25% to 30% from your usual sizing. Uh, that's all for canadian okay so forex the six major pairs i have gone over for the outlook for today i'll be coming up later for the index crude and gold market outlook thank you william here signing off bye bye